happy Christmas Eve. Hello. Oh my goodness, I get in here and there's a hype train almost starting. What are you doing? Hey Blink, Blink was first. Hi Spicy, hey Aflav, thank you for the lurk, I appreciate you. Merry Christmas Isla, thank you so much for the resub. Nine months, look at you go. It's so good to see you in here again, I hope you're doing well. Hey Ari, how are you doing? Thank you so much for the resub. And Rail, how are you doing? Oh my goodness, look at all you lovelies in here today. It's Christmas in 57 minutes. Oh, do we get to celebrate Christmas with you? Oh, I was so excited. Spicy. Thank you so much for sharing a little bit of your Christmas with us. Hey, Saf, how are you doing? Most of us are restricted internet for a week. And here I'm back. So glad you're back. Thank you so much for coming by today. 59% magic. <laughs> oh my goodness. What is happening? Maybe Dick to Satisfactory again. I mean, it is a pretty fun game. 14% magic for Plink. 59 for Rosario System. Bro, thank you so much for the gifty sub. That's so sweet. Merry Christmas, Healy. How are you doing? Oh, look at all you lovelies in here. We are going to get festive. 26% magic for Isla. <laughs> it's on a little five second cooldown, so. Just, uh. Muster all that magic together and hit that <laughs> hit that command again. You never feel that magic? Oh, I promise you, Ari, you are so magical. I know that you've had a stressful day today, but don't message those people back. Just come here and talk about lovely things. Meredith, thank you so much for the biddies. Appreciate you. Thank you. I hope you're feeling good today. Uh, oh, is it the cooldown? Yeah, it's because you're super magic. That's why. Uh... This is my third world in Satisfactory. This time I'm an expert in the desert. It's a different way of starting. Ooh, interesting. Like more difficult or just interesting? <laughs> Watching traditional Norwegian Christmas TV. That's so sweet. Oh, sounds so lovely. And again, yeah. <laughs> Gravity face is 62%. Yes. You don't feel the magic. Maybe it knows you a little boost. Yeah, I think so. If you're not quite 36, we will try our best to make you as magic as possible. Ooh, 6%. I think you're a bit more magic than that, Saf. I'd rather not know. What are we working on today? Working on... Oh, thank you for the hug, Aflaf. I appreciate you. And thank you for the lurk, Mia. Uh, we are finishing off our little Christmas reindeer today. Right, after watching Smackdown, chucking biddies and then say hello. <laughs> well, I very much appreciate the biddies and I appreciate you being here, Meredith. You need behaving? Oh, Ari. Don't you worry. Just come and hang out in here with us and have a nice chill time. Thank you for the lurk. I appreciate you. Come back anytime, okay? Merry Festivus! <gasps> no! Oh, Stardust. I'm so sorry, buddy. And I, here I was asking how the move went, but... But yes, Merry Festivus to the rest of us. <laughs> we watched the Festivus episode last night. <laughs> But yeah, I hope you feel better soon. I hope it's not what you think it is. Morning, Tweedle. Not stopping. I just popped on to wish everybody a Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas, Tweedle. Thank you so much for being here. Appreciate you. I hope you have a lovely, lovely Christmas. And I'll speak to you again soon. 33% magic for rail. Love it. Started to unlock my natural consistent art cell. Going to post in the Discord along with a succubus in a bikini. Is okay. I think it's okay, Saf. The airing of grievances and the feats of strength. Yes. <laughs> 42% magic for Tweedle. That's pretty damn good to me. Not to shock anyone, but actually going to have Loom content over Christmas. <gasps> Ooh, have we had a shout out for Crafty Face? If not, just tap on tap on Crafty's name there and give her a little follow. Make sure you check her out when she goes live. Oh, snacks. Thanks, Saf. I could do with some snacks right now. So what I decided I was going to do, because I wasn't entirely happy. This is what happens sometimes. I'm not entirely happy with, like, the complete shape of our little reindeer fellow here. So I'm just going to take a little bit of time today, kind of reshaping the body a little bit to where I want it to be. So it looks a bit more reindeer-y. Leave through for a moment. That's all right, Saf. We're here whenever you need us, okay? Can't test my plate. It's a low and the nose is dry to nosebleeds every time I try to swab. Oh, bud, I'm sorry. Just make sure you take care of yourself for, for the time being. Did you have any plans over Christmas, or is it staying with your parents? 
Emery's saying I write it down as if to send it and then erase it. Yes, very much so. That's a very, very good idea. If you've got like a notepad thing on your phone so it's not like directly there, because I always worry that I'll accidentally hit send. Uh, learned some, learned some not good things yesterday and now I feel yuck. Oh, spicy. I'm sorry to hear that. But we're here for you. If you want to be distracted from it for a little bit, that's fine. If you want to talk about it, that's fine too. You can talk in here, you can talk in the Discord, whatever feels right to you, okay? But we're here. Time for some morning coffee and for all the cat wants turkey. Well, of course. Why would you not want turkey? And especially at this time of year. I'm going to get my vegan card revoked one of these days, I swear. Just encouraging people to eat turkey. Well, encouraging cats to eat turkey. I think that's okay. <laughs> After cannot confirm or deny, she's going to try and have a big long stream at this point. It's just a list of games and crafts on a pickle wheel, so prepared. I mean, you know, sometimes I come on stream and I'm like, I don't even know what I'm making today. <laughs> you do? Yes. I won't say much, and it's potentially triggering our obsessive brothers, but I appreciate that. Spicy, uh, you know where my DMs are, and you can always just drop a message to any of us if you feel comfortable doing it. Isha, thank you so much for the resub! Anton, thank you for the resub! My goodness, the resub! <laughs> runs in, gives crazy big hugs, runs out again for family time. Have a wonderful time with your family, Anton. Thank you so much for the resub, and Merry Christmas to you and yours. Uh, came home in time to do the things and now we got COVID. My sister's got it too. Oh, Stardust, I'm so sorry. We have a safe space and you can spoiler it. Yes, you can. Uh, hello and Merry Winter Holidays. Folks, thank you so much for that little, uh, little hype train there. I really, really appreciate it. Thank you so, so much for all of your love and support over the last, over the last almost year. We are going to be a year of streaming in February, so we're going to do something exciting for that, I'm sure. I have no idea what yet. So special report for work on Christmas Eve. No, 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 Luke. Don't worry about it. Can someone please tell Eat, Pray, Luke that he should go and hang out with his family over Christmas and he is not expected to work? Uh... <laughs> you think my poor succubus is an e-cup? Oh, goodness. Gonna fall over. How to wake up husband. Have a lovely stream. You'll take care. Merry Christmas. Love you lots, Antan. We'll speak to you again soon. Uh, can't you be streaming a year? Almost a year, yeah, in February. How wild is that? <laughs> Where for Christmas can't talk to Luke. <laughs> oh, Meredith. I hope that you enjoy it, at least. But surely... That I'm working for Christmas. Surely you should be recovering from your surgery, Meredith. No? Uh, and you finished work yesterday myself. Yep, same age of fear. Hey, Winter, how are you doing? Welcome in. Good to see you. This isn't cat made needlecraft. No, I'm afraid it isn't. <laughs> I don't know how much cosplay I can do with hands, Jesse, but it's good to see you. How are you doing? Hey, Sassy. Good to see you in here. I think it's basically can't remember your policy on art sharing. Yep. Um, I mean, we try and keep it um, safe for work, but clothed people is absolutely fine. So I'm looking forward to seeing it, Saf. Thank you so much for sharing your work. Make him spill coffee. Make food. Yeah, see? Aflaf and you. You've got the, you've got the same brain. <laughs> Make him some yummy food or yummy coffee or whatever his favourite thing is and just waft it under the door. Up and about unlimited pain relief. Okay, that's good. Just make sure that you take care of yourself. I know that you know how to take care of yourself, Meredith. And I am not here to tell you what to do. But we care about you and we want to make sure that you have a good and restful Christmas, okay? Uh, I can make a cat made. I could. I can make a cat made. Can pick a bunch of different things. The, uh, the possibilities are endless with needle crafting. Needle felting? Needle felting. There we go. Bacon's a good choice. I mean, it is. You're not wrong. And then send it to Kay. <laughs> Specifically, um, uh, whether I look while streaming. Whether I oh, no, I don't. I apologize. Um, no, what I usually do is I look either on my break, um, which is sort of two hours in. Or I look on my... Uh, when I finish stream. Because sometimes the Discord can get a little bit... As Plink can attest to from him saying it the other week. The uh, the Discord can get pretty... Uh, 
can blow up pretty hard during the stream because a lot we have a lot of lovely people sharing all their lovely stuff so uh hey is reindeer not safe for work <laughs> i mean i think i think our stream here is pretty safe for work it's just uh posting stuff in posting things in the discord but um yeah we're vaguely family friendly sort of right made the vegan ham yesterday and boiled it in homemade broth and this morning I had the broth of soup so good can't wait to taste the ham oh sounds good 25 degrees at 9 p.m winter no thank you for tweeting out the stream loot I appreciate you bet chat shares during stream exactly because there's people around to share with yeah I think so I'd be, I'd be googling reindeer <laughs> live with some cute ones morning law how are we doing uh, may not make it to the break from on my phone at less than 20% battery. No worries, Seth. Like, the time that you spend here, I really, really appreciate it. It's always good to see you in here. Uh, my grandpa used to wake up cooking bacon when I was little. Nice! I mean, there are much worse ways to wake up than that. <laughs> How we doing, Law? How you feeling? How's House Gown Law feeling today? <laughs> Let's get these legs kind of shaped a little bit more. Yep, that looks a little better. Get this one looking nice. Thank you for tweeting out the stream after left. I appreciate you. Don't want to be awake, still tired, buddy. Do you have much to do today, or are you uh, are you able to chill a little bit, a little tiny bit for cozy? Hmm? Uh, Mother-in-law, we haven't seen in two years. Is due to visit. So oh, okay, okay. I mean, yep. <laughs> I didn't celebrate Christmas or not this year, but a friend is bringing my Christmas leftovers tomorrow night in roughly 21 hours and I'm feeling loved. You are loved, Saf. You are very, very loved. But, yeah, I totally get you with the with the not celebrating Christmas. And if there are people in here who are not celebrating, not feeling festive, that's fine. You know that that's fine. I'm here to tell you that it is okay if you don't feel particularly festive. I know that everyone thinks that people are weird who, you know, are not into Christmas, but it's a really emotionally tiring time so cold the heat is dropping the wind is shaking the house oh sassy i'm so sorry i hope that you can stay warm uh been awake to 132 days in a row no definitely wasn't playing satisfactory for late i mean were you or were you i hope that you can stay warm sassy and sending you all the warm cozy vibes plan to do as little as possible i've done too much work this week my body hates me yep don't pick a day off my body yes your body will pick one for you soob yes it will pick one for you soob <laughs> Soup is becoming a thing now. Uh, my mum got me a vegan coconut key lime pie. Oh, that sounds amazing. I have a um, I have a vegan Biscoff cheesecake. Yum. Uh, yep. Yeah, whether you do or don't, love you all the same. Agreed. Um, I used to love bacon. My grandpa. I mean, I still love my grandpa, but he's no longer with us. Don't have bacon now though. Yeah, but you can get some veggie stuff. Hopefully, there's some good veggie stuff. Uh, having an absolutely low-key break, no gifts, no people, so have enough spoons saved up to make lunch tomorrow. That sounds like a good plan, Plank. It sounds like you know your boundaries and you know what is going to work for you, and that's a good thing. Yeah, no worries, Winter. Like, yeah, thanks for saying that. A lot of people are freaked out. I didn't want to do Christmas this year. It's fine. Like, I find Christmas quite tiring, you know? I've got a big family, so it's it's kind of like building myself up for that. Big hugs for Healy, yes. Uh, friendly preemptive reminder to chat not to be hugged, loved, head pats, glitter, cookies, and any form of affection are appreciated. I am f totally fine with that, Saf. If anyone forgets, it's not intentional, we're just a very huggy bunch, but we will do our best to make sure that we remember that. I will put in a few extra commands for non-huggy related uh, signs of affection, okay? Coconut key lime pies, yummo. To have the chocolate option. Dropping half of it at the sink. Oh no, spicy! Started a new job last week. Neglected to tell me they do a week in hand when you first start. And next, next week's a three day week. Oh! Okay. Well, that's not helpful. The only jobs that need to be done is feed people and wrap presents. Anything else can wait. Agreed. There we go. Big smiles for Saf. Did Pina get a present? Of course she did! I'm not going to get angry. Make it be flashbacks or something rather on present. That is totally fine, Saf. There is no no explanation needed unless you feel like you want to give one. But we will totally understand that just you're not into hugs and that is fine. So we'll do our best to remember, okay? Morning, JR. How you doing? <laughs> Are you a sleepy bear today? Fresh hot bread with butter and cheese and pesto and bell pepper slices. 
Healy, can I have some, please? That sounds amazing. In fact, I'm going to start my day with a bath. That is a fantastic idea, Law. I fully support that. Go and hang out in the bath. I will probably do the same later. Thanks, all feeling the love as always. Yeah, we love you, Saf. We love you very, very much. I'm really glad that you're here with us. I'm so glad that you found this little gang and that you feel at home here. And that's all I need. Uh, fresh post meal is definitely something good to wake up to. It is, right? Do you know, because you've got the bread maker, haven't you, Plink? Have you got one of the ones where you can set a timer for it to start cooking? So you can put the ingredients in like the night before and then wake up to uh, bread, bread smells. Need to get wrapping paper. Oh, did you get gifts, JR? That's nice. Um, first time around this year I baked cookies. People are so happy with the Christmas cookies. I put the cookies away and got in bed. Cookies! We love Christmas cookies, though. Gonna make some hot chocolate. Nice. Oh, I've got my chocolate milk. I'm gonna have some in a minute. Family is a perfect tradition. Dad has five sisters. Only really talks to one and only relatively friendly with two others. Christmas is just my mum, dad, brother, and I do Christmas Eve dinner. Mum's Polish tradition. Nice. And the four of us do Christmas brekkie and dinner, so dinner ourselves. Yeah. Yeah, we got high fives. There we go. Saf, how do you feel about high fives? Work on some more before I start doing chores for you. No worries, Aflaf. You keep going. Oh, for your dad. Nice. Do you want to tell us what you got him? You don't have to, but he's not going to see this. So we get to we get to have the fun surprise too. Got the good ones. Timer and ingredient tray. <gasps> cinnamon and raisin bread. <gasps> I want cinnamon and raisin bread. That sounds amazing. Yeah, you have Christmas Eve and Christmas Day. Yeah. So you have people who have the Christmas Eve uh, places in Europe where Christmas Eve is the day, is the is the big one. So anyone who's celebrating today, all the love to you. I hope you have a wonderful, wonderful day. You absolutely deserve it. I'm excited because I know what I'm getting. Oh, you know what you're getting, Spicy? I want to know. Sometimes when aren't their kids and their kids will meet up on Boxing Day. Yeah, I have that. Like several generations of people. We're meeting ours on the 28th, so... I went for a succubus with my graffiti street art and has featured demons and the occasional angel. I mean, I do love a demon. Speaking of which, haven't got your mail yet. Boo. It's okay. It's not time sensitive. It's not um, expirable or anything like that. Like, when it arrives, I just hope that you enjoy it. And it'll be a nice surprise when it does. Yeah, silly royal mail. I mean, I do support. High five. Perfect. We shall high five you. Saf? <laughs> hot, water, hot water feels nice on ouchy legs. I can imagine. Just get in there and have a nice relax, Laura. You have absolutely earned it. You work so hard and I'm so, so proud of you. But also, you should rest more because we love you. Are you okay, Ari? Pen for my tablets on a digital arts. Yes, spicy. Oh, I'm so excited. It's really, really fun learning. I need to like dedicate more time to doing some digital art. Uh, ooh, ooh, ooh. Yeah, high five for Saf. Hey, friendo. Folks, can you join me, please, in wishing a very big, very lovely happy birthday to the wonderful Mr. Friendo Baggins. It was his birthday yesterday. We got to celebrate with him a little bit, but we are celebrating here today, too. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> that is true, Ari. That was, uh, that was a fact from last week, in fact. Because it used to be, yeah, Dasher, Dancer, Prancer, Vixen, Comic Cuban, Dunder and Blixen, which is like colloquial New York Dutch for uh, Thunder and Lightning. And then it changed to Donner and Blitzen, which was more like a German spelling later on. But Rudolph didn't show up until 1939. And then in the 1945 song that everybody knows. But before that, he was never around. So I don't know how he's the most famous reindeer of all, really. But yeah, happy birthday, friendo. I hope you had a lovely day yesterday. It was so good hanging out with you. Oh, snuggles in the pillow for it sounds good. Not a fan of hugs. Suffer it if needed. Handshake, fist bump, or hug. Explaining why I'm not a fan of hugs. No worries, Asia. We got high fives. I think we got cookies. All sorts of stuff. We don't have to hug. Hugs are for people who want them. They are not required. Um, that's okay. You can do pillow, I think. Um, and that just throws a pillow at someone, Saf. Got Josh the extra large version of the blue kids plate with the handle that you use under your butt to slide down snowy hills. Oh, Healy, that's so cute. <laughs> Isn't that wild, Ari? It's so good. It was a fun day. It really was. I had a great time. <laughs> Collate suggestions in Discord. Do it, Blink. 
was supposed to be friendly. It's okay. As I said, I will um I will put a, a bit more of a description of what each one does. So to make sure that the actions are something that people are comfortable with doing or with, with giving or receiving. So that we're, we're as comfy as possible. I want to make sure that, you know, that's what we're here for. To make everybody sure that everybody feels as comfortable and as cosy as possible. So you did make quite a lot of gingerbread. Is there any more left over? I should have grabbed some on my way out. It was good. Let it be known. JR Plays Games makes excellent gingerbread. Go. Fist bump. <laughs> I mean, exclamation point fist, maybe not, but we could do bump. <gasps> and speaking of bacon sandwiches, thank you very much. Yum. I got my veggie bacon sandwich. I'm ready. Rudolph's created to sell toys and the song came after. Yes, pretty much. And that's why he's famous. Uh, always ask if someone wants a hug and if not, it's okay. Yeah, and we absolutely should. Um, mm -hmm. Not bad, we weren't too messy last night. Are you sure? Uh, uh, uh. Yeah, Spud's a good one. Uh, Tipped students on a hike up a really tall hill the other day and spent 10 minutes sliding down on those plates. It was a test run in preparation for Josh's gift. Gonna do the same with him tomorrow. That's so sweet, though. I'm glad that you guys have got snow. We got the tiniest amount. Um, yeah, we got the tiniest of dusting of snow, but then it was so cold afterwards that the snow didn't go away. But it wasn't anything, it wasn't a massive amount of snow. Um, it means in terms of leaving a physical mess. I mean, personal, it, personal mess is, you know. <laughs> Mother and Rosh, do you see him just having a bath? See that wizard anywhere? Let him know a cup of tea might be very nice. Yes, Gandalf, if you are listening, a cup of tea for your wonderful partner who does so much and never stopped yesterday <laughs> until they had to. And they do so much around the house and they absolutely deserve a lovely cup of tea. I have so much above my knees. Healy! Goodness. <laughs> uh, don't know where he is. Keep hearing his voice floating about places. I mean, that sounds kind of creepy when you say it like that. Just... He's, he's in the ether somewhere. Alright, let's just cover up that bit a little bit. The cat... Really? The cat loves it? when you consider that like this is this is Dante's first first winter in Norway right so first winter having this huge amount of snow I got my faking got my faking sandwich <laughs> it's trying to convince E into some clothes nah that's not gonna happen trying to put, yeah trying to put clothes on a tiny little whirlwind foggy head needs breakfast involves standing up much less moving I mean just take it one step at a time plank and remember that you're gonna have the reward of delicious breakfast at the end of it Hey, Crafty! Time for a cup of coffee. Good plan. Made a skull painting that was supposed to have red liberty spikes, but ended up looking kind of appropriate. Oh, like a Christmassy one? Hey, Rose Petal, how are you doing? 49% magic. That's a good start. How are you doing today? Why would we get dressed for Grandma? I mean, how dare. <laughs> Why bother? Uh, FLT, yeah, bacon, bacon, lettuce, and tomato. Even though I'm not a fan of lettuce and tomato. Oh, appropriative. Oh, I see. I thought I thought it said appropriate. I apologise. I think I read. I misread. But is it the colour or the the arrangement of the spikes? Cat loves sitting by my car, watching me in the neighbour exhaust myself. Yeah, the cat is just like chuckling, chuckling to themselves. <laughs> Ah, voodoo skull with feathers. Yeah, I mean, it might be worth doing some research to see whether that is something that is, um, like, whether you feel that it it invokes a certain feeling. You know what I mean? I want to try faking so much. Oh, <gasps> really? I mean, if you have any plans to come back to London at any point um, for Jay family visiting, then, um, oh, yeah, Crafty's putting the, uh, putting the kettle on. Everyone say what we want. I think a BLT beetroot lettuce tomato. I mean, beetroot's yum. Go much to get the whole small child experience and seeing she's missed so much of his life climbing, yelling, jumping, and nudity. Agreed. <laughs> and telling everyone to stop just because. <laughs> yeah, bacon is delicious. Yeah, so Healy, if you come if you come back over um, to London at any point and you feel ready to 
meet up or hang out or whatever, then I'm always happy to come to London and I'll take you out for delicious vegan food. How's that sound? Coffee for Rose and tea for... <laughs> just tea, thank you. I don't fancy the wine, no? Just tea. Oh, I want to watch Lord of the Rings now. I want to watch The Hobbit now. Oat hot chocky. Mmm, yeah. One for me, please. That sounds good. Did not appreciate the adults having sort of fun. <laughs> yeah. Stop. I don't know. I got I got good face squishes from, from E yesterday. Law's youngest, if he if he really likes you, gives you good cheek squishes. Hey Sidda! Want bacon but hate cooking it. I mean that's totally fair. But I hope you're well. Maybe you can find someone else to do it for you. Josh is awake. <gasps> hey, Josh. Use the Beyond Bucket to make a mush for my Wellingtons. Oh, yum. That sounds good. Peppermint schnapps in white coffee. I mean, Saf. You know how to party. I love it. I think the child doing that an awkward one. <laughs> it depends, you know, if she's a drinker. See me cookies and cream hot chocolate. Thank you, Meredith. That sounds delish. Thank you very much. Just tea. Yeah. Just tea. Thank you. Gotta do the Gandalf, right? Uh, I'll bring some fake in. That's true. You could. As long as Norway's not too funny about you bringing, like, refrigerated food into the country, then you can absolutely take some fake in over there. I can... I'll give you some recommendations, Aflaf, on the really good stuff so you know... And then you can uh, make sure you take my my favourite ones over there for Healy, for Healy and Josh to enjoy. Does that sound good? Uh, let's get these leggies looking good. And then I think after that we've got, like, got to sort out the cute face. Reindeer needs a cute little tail. Needs some antlers. Hey, Mama, why you see? How are you doing? Happy holidays to you. I hope you are doing well. Good to see you in here. In custom, you say it's okay, it's fake. I mean, yeah. <laughs> Technically, yes. It should work that way. <laughs> but yeah, I hope that uh, I hope that you do get to try it. I hope you enjoy it. Yeah. You have to make sure it's okay first. Ah, you have to do a taste test, Afla, if I see and, and that it's okay to take it into the country. I'm sure it should be fine, but it's definitely worth checking. You don't want to get in trouble when you go over there. Not a heavy drinker. Describe my drinking style as a drop or two every day or two, mostly for flavour, ready for effect. Uh, I have I usually have a nice bottle or two in the house, but more than that, that's fine. Uh, hey, Schick. Uh, if you say please, I might. Just going to bribe you for the woos now. <laughs> Pretty good, gonna be quite warm tomorrow, really. Oh, it's it's dreary, drizzly December around here. Uh, just got a Snapchat from my brother while at work. He isn't all dolled up and fabulous, but he is sporting a full pink glittered beard. Oh, he's just glorious, though. Love him. Always, always nice to see some fun pictures from, uh, from Law's fabulous brother. 30 degrees, mama! Which state are you in? I apologize, I can't remember. Because we've got a few people from America who are getting freezing weather, but it's, um, you know, they're, they're up in, like, PA and stuff, so. Hey, Drifting Light! Welcome in! Good to see you in here. I hope you're doing well. Can we have a shout-out for Drifting Light, please? Ah, oh, Victoria! Ah, oh, of course, yes! Not state. Yes. Dyed apart pink eyebrows. So it was also put glitter on the pink bit. <gasps> I love that! I mean, I thought the other day about making my eyebrows green. Not dyeing them, but, um... Yeah, Merry Christmas! Merry Christmas to you! Is it Merry Christmas now? Yes! Yeah, thank you for shouting out Drifting Light. Drifting Light's a member of uh, JR's community, and I'm really glad to see you over here. I hope you are having a lovely, lovely day today. I'm chair dancing. You can't see it, but it's adorable. <laughs> Merry Christmas, happy holidays, don't celebrate. Yeah, have a lovely weekend. Exactly, I was just like, uh, Merry Christmas, happy Hanukkah, happy holidays, Yule blessings, or happy weekend. How are you feeling? 
Christmas Eve definitely counts. Absolutely. Heard on the news there was a huge snowstorm in the States. Yes, uh, I think Sassy is in the States. Figured Aflaf was busy with the commands for a minute. Yes, I really appreciate all of your work, Aflaf. I appreciate you very, very much. It's just some people might uh, see that term uh, in a completely different, non-wholesome way. That's all. But that can be changed. It's fine. Happy Festivus. Yep. Yeah. It's best of us for the rest of us. <laughs> a few more things to do before I can call myself Christmas ready. It's not a lot, so I can take it easy. Yes, 67. Nice, friendo. My plans for tomorrow are um, going to hang out with my in-laws, my family. Um, we've got, I think, at least one grandkid there. So he's a lot of fun because he's not even two yet. Um, so we're going to have lots of fun there. We're going to have lots of yummy foods. I've got a really delicious vegan main that I'm very excited to try. Um, and then we, yeah. Yeah, happy holidays, Bloofy. So lovely to see you in here. Thank you, Crafty, for the round. Appreciate you. Hey, Evie. Happy Christmas Eve. Hope you're doing well. Um, yeah, so we do present opening and then we do lunch and then we do, you know, classic Christmas movies and hang out and just have a nice time and look for our prezies and just spend time together. And then Boxing Day, we usually go back and it's like other members of the family that come along on that day. And then I've got my big family gathering on the 28th, which is like about 30 of us. <laughs> Brendo is magic. Yes, he is. He is big and tall and magic. <laughs> yeah, how you doing, Evie? Are you excited for the Christmas for the Christmas tree? Anyone who, who hasn't met Evie before, say hello. Uh, Evie is my niece. And it's really nice to have you in here. Gonna watch Elf today? Yes! What a plan. I haven't been able to find it on any of the streaming services, which is very annoying. But um, we will see whether we can find it somewhere. Got some more decorations, because it's, it's my money. If I want to spend it on decorative birds and pretty sparkly stuff, I will. I fully support that drifting. <laughs> Well, I, I am fully subscribed to, I'm an adult and I get, to decide, I get to decide what that means. I work hard for this money, I can spend it on what I want, as long as I've got what I need covered, I can spend the rest on what I want. And I fully support that. It's on Disney Plus? Really? <gasps> I'm excited. I didn't know it was. It sounds wonderful. Vegan Maine, I know, right? It is a vegan turkey crown with stuffing and little crisscross vegan bacon on the top. I'm excited. Just get that with a bunch of roasties and some veggies, and you have a delicious Christmas dinner. Uh, if it comes out looking great, then I will take some photos of it and stick it in the Discord! Exclamation point Discord! If you feel like sharing your delicious Christmas slash festive slash treat yourself because you totally deserve it meals, there is a uh, comfort food and recipes section as well. You can always put something yummy in there. We are adults and we have adult money. I know, it's quite scary to think we're adults and we have adult money, but, like I said, we absolutely deserve to treat ourselves all the time, but at this time of year, I think, especially, because we put ourselves through a lot, don't we? Like a slow roast? Yes, pretty much. I think, I can't remember what it's made of, but I will I will uh, let you know later, Bloopy, and I'll take a little picture. <laughs> Uh, bought a big chunk of obsidian that I was drawn to, got half price, ended up being 15 uh, Australian dollars, roughly about 8 quid, sizing my rather large fist and probably over a kilo. <gasps> Obsidian's good stuff though. I hope that, uh, give it, give it a good, give it a good old cleanse and, uh, you love the lights at the top of the stream? You're the first person to say anything about it, if, unless I've missed them, but yeah. Decided to get some little lights up the top there. <laughs> Elf is on Prime, you have to rent it, but Home Alone's on Disney Plus. Ah, I see. I watched Home Alone already. I watched it twice <laughs> this this December. Fancy Indian takeaway. Oh, that sounds good, Crafty. I had delicious, uh, delicious curry at Law's house last night. There we go. Oh, I love that one, Aflav. Girl, fist bump and an offer of a comfy seat. How's that sound? I love it. Yeah, Law made this delicious uh, combination of two different curries. It was a uh, vegan butter chicken um, and a uh, garlic and mushroom biryani um, with rice. And oh, I could have just eaten the entire thing. Cute Christmas lights. Yeah, look. Ta-da. <laughs> just swaying around up there. 
don't forget you got your uh, you got your frost spells and your snow spells if you feel like being festive and some sparkles as well yeah we got sparkles and rain but i don't know how much we want rain right now but yes oh i love it thank you aflaf I'll pop those in the commands list in the uh, in the section below. So if you don't know, we've got some commands down here. Oh, and the protection spell. Thank you, Plink. Appreciate you. <laughs> and the frost spell. I'm impressed if you if you could. I made a lot of curry. I mean, that just sounds like a challenge, Law. I'm willing to come round again today and uh, see that happen. You need to wait for the creation of Jesus for flight. Hey, I know how that feels, Afflaf. Don't you worry. Did an awesome job, bud. Thank you so much. Yeah, I think that could be a challenge. I'll just storm in the door when, you're, uh, when your mother-in-law is there and just be like, <laughs> I am here for the curry. <laughs> they have to make it again. I mean, yeah, okay. I'm up for that. <laughs> well, come round. I'll help you make the curry. And then I'll just eat it all. G yeah, garlic yeah, garlic mushroom biryani and butter chicken. Totally steal those Christmas lights from my screen. <laughs> I'll, uh, I can send you the link to where I got them from if you like, Crafty. Uh, have cleansed it, found it strangely energising, aligns well with my style of craft, protection, banishing, divination, cleansing, reflecting, influence, hexing, cursing, and jinxing with random. <laughs> yes, hexing and cursing, be careful. The, uh, gentle, a gentle jinx is fine. A tiny, a tiny little, uh, tiny little bit of that is okay, but let's make sure it doesn't fling it back at you, but... Clean plates and no leftovers. It was so delicious. Oh, hydrate. Thank you, Rose. Folks, if you join me in a hydrate, please. Craft, you did the round earlier, so I know that you've all got your beverages. So have a little drinky with me. And don't forget your meds as well. This is a reminder. Go take them. That's been all right. No mistakes with plates. They fall for long. Yes. Of course, Crafty. A tiny little nudging. <laughs> Just a little one. Just one. As a treat. <laughs> Very careful and well thought out, and I do go strong with litmus test. Would I do this? Yeah, exactly. Would you do it in person? And it's just being careful. 11% magic. Oh, buddy. That's all right. You just got to wait for the food to digest, and then you'll be feeling magic AF. I think that's the first time I've ever seen, ever said AF before, but there you go. <laughs> I'm seeing whether I can get a bit more of a balance on the colour, but I think this guy's just going to be a bit marbly brown-orange. Looks not particularly attractive right now, but still. Coffee counts as hydration. I mean, it has water in it, so sure. Just make sure you have a little water as well as the coffee, and then we're all good. Favourite part of cooking is the smell kept summoning people to go, Ooh, that smells so good. I mean, yeah, I do that a lot. <laughs> just wander in going, that smells great. Anything that it rained it looks like eyes. I mean, oh no, that looks like Baymax. I don't like it. That's creepy. <laughs> and we got the ghosties as well. Yes, everybody should be remembering that Christmas Eve is a wonderful time to be reading a little ghost story. Um, one of the one of, one of the great things that uh, the Victorians did for us is uh, the tradition of ghost stories at Christmas on Christmas Eve would recommend <laughs> jinx those bitches <laughs> uh, all fluids count for helping you hydrate except alcohol but water is best yes uh, according to the information leaves it's a bit up in the bathroom so the hospitals where I work yes well I think yeah there's probably a lot of like yeah a lot of energy drink drinking that happens I try my best to keep my water intake up but easy drinks is a minor prank not maliciously yeah good idea the wizard's brought you tea. Yes, wizard. Always time for ghost stuff. That is true. Hey, Huvian. Happy Christmas Eve. Hope you're doing well today. Thank you so much for coming by. It's your Merry Christmas and Magical Day. I know it can be a tough day for some. I'm off to bed. Yeah, it can be a very tough day. But if we're all there for each other and we know our limits and our boundaries and we rest when we need to and realise that those you don't have to keep to those traditions if you don't like them, you know? You can do your own thing and... and celebrate in your own way but thank you so much for coming by mama yc love to yc i hope that you have a wonderful christmas and i'll see you again soon time for a cheeky mince pie it's always time for a cheeky mince pie it's december <laughs> 
but yeah, I hope that you will have a lovely, uh, a lovely Christmas. Um, I know of at least one person who is streaming tomorrow and providing a little space for people to hang out if they need to get away. Um, if you know of anybody else who is streaming tomorrow, um, then please let me know so that we can uh, tell our little community where they can go to go and hang out and chill if they need. Raw Obsidian Chunk has one natural surface that makes her a great black mirror. Ooh, Saf, do some scrying. That could be fun. Yeah, there we go. We have a, have a little elbow. A little elbow nod. Now sip this and enjoy it and wash my hair and get myself human resembling. <laughs> Nearly time to sort some food. Oh, we have it, Hoovian. Uh, Sleeping Luna designs will be sleeping tomorrow. Sleeping Luna? Oh, Sleeping Luna will be streaming tomorrow. Okay. Um, do you have... Can you pop their username? Not their link. It doesn't need to be the full link. Just the username. And if we can make a note, mods, of um, uh, any names that get popped in for uh, who is streaming tomorrow. Because I want to see whether we can provide a list of, uh, of people that... Because I will not be streaming tomorrow. I meant to say that. First of all, I will not be streaming tomorrow. Uh, I'll be hanging out with my family and just having a little bit of downtime. Also, next week, I'll be streaming on New Year's Eve, but not on New Year's Day. So I'm going to take a little Sunday off to just enjoy the new year. Owls for some reason. Oh, I love owls. Uh, made those chocolate pots using silken tofu. I aren't vegan quite yet, but I'll try with dark chocolate and almond milk reduction. Oh, that sounds good, Blue P. Yes, please. And I love grazing food. It is the season for grazing food. Yes. Uh, yeah, Sleeping Lunar Design. Sidder, if you've got this, the correct spelling of their um, Twitch name, I'd really appreciate it because that sounds like a lovely place to hang out. Um... But yeah, I can see whether I can find... I'm sure there might be some uh, like vegan chocolate pudding recipes, Bloopy, and we'll do a little recipe swap. And then we'll do our reviews of whether we like them or not. Or, oh, you scried and kept seeing owls. Interesting. I wonder what that could mean. I'm on mobile, sleeping in designs. Perfect. Yeah, mods, if you could jot that down for me, I'd really, really appreciate it. Then we can go and make some new friendos. We'll go and give them all a follow. And then uh, we know where we can send people if they need a place to hang out tomorrow. Want chocolate pudding now? Yeah! I want chocolate pudding also. There you go, Plink. See? Mince pie. Mince pie did it. Mince pie magic. I have loads of pigs in blankets. It's my concession to Christmas food. Yes. I haven't got any, actually. I mean, I am. Uh, Limitilly. Welcome in. How are you doing today? You're going to pop. You're bopping into the music. I love it. 41% Sidda. Also have a chocolate log. Yeah, Sleeping Lunar Designs. Thank you so much for that. I will, um, as I said, I will pop them in the Discord. Exclamation point Discord, if you are not part of the Discord server already. We are a lovely little, a lovely little comfy, cosy community in there. We'd love to have you in there with us. Um, and, uh, yeah, I'm going to see whether I can compile a little list of uh, lovely streamers who will be streaming tomorrow on Christmas Day. So if you need somewhere to go and hang out, if you want to go and chill, if you want to escape from stressful stuff, then uh, you've got somewhere to go. And hang out with good people. That sound nice? In a bar, some helpfulness is limited. No worries. Have my own needle felting kits to play with over the break. I'm very excited about it. <gasps> Ooh, I'm excited too. Please feel free to share your work when it's done. Works in progress are always appreciated as well. But I'm really, really excited that we've got more people trying needle felting. Because it's very, very fun. I hope that you enjoy it. I will do my best to help if you need anything. I am not an expert in these things. But uh, it is... Uh, still very fun to practice right no you don't worry about that law you have some nice restings everybody's on chill mode i think now so listen to mlp christmas music because it slaps it also gives the christmas vibes without being songs i've heard a million times over that is true that's a very good idea i've got a little wreath with a sleeping fox at the bottom loads of toadstools oh i love a toadstool and wee smiley mouse face with a floral crown in the frame that sounds gorgeous Oh, I just got the wrapping paper scissor glide. Oh, I love it. That is a that is a, a Christmas joy, I believe. <laughs> That's so good. But yeah, Tilly, they, those sound amazing. I cannot wait. Like, I really hope you enjoy them. And if you feel like sharing the pictures, I would love to see your work. Uh, since Athena is a deity of wisdom, yeah, true. That is true. 
to be yeah usually owls is wisdom but there are there are other things it depends on which um which pantheon i guess wrapping paper scissor glass the best it is right but the dionysus hermes and nurgle wow i've been drawn to athena for a while there we go she's calling to you that's kind of awesome uh, sip my tea, give yourself a quick scrub, wash your hair, hop out and wear the human's clothes. I mean, yeah. Unfortunately, human clothes have to be a thing. Got my PCR swap appointment from 1 hour 10 from now. All the positive vibes for you, Stardust. I hope that it is not what you think it is and that you feel better soon. But we are here. Give us love. Let us know how you're doing. When I finish my laundry, do a nail polish touch up and then I'm basically done for the day. That's perfect, Drifting. What nails are we going for? What colours? Any decorations? We got fancy nails going on. But yeah, lots of love to Stardust, please. That they're going to uh, they're going to ace the test <laughs> or fail the test. Really, that's kind of the main one. Emoth's a great be Emoth. It's such a good word. <laughs> this is just not blending together. Excuse me, folks. 10 to 11. Goodness. I am going to finish this one today. Red and green holographic glitter. Oh, see when I, um, I don't wear nail polish that much anymore because I always used to just, uh, I never used to keep them like touched up and looking pretty. But when I did, I had this amazing red with the, with this beautiful like color shifting glitter in it. And I used to just stare at my nails. <laughs> like, ADHD shiny brain was just like, oh, this looks good. I hope you immediately stop feeling poorly. Yes, Sidda. I love that energy. It just stop feeling poorly right now. <laughs> Broken acrylic now, trying to pop open a hot drink container. Tells it was a screw lid. No, crafty. Ouch. Oh, nail stuff. Oof. Drawn to archery for a long time and I had to fire a bow. I just don't have one right now. Yeah, I mean, all of this seems to be coming together a little bit, Saf. I love you, Green. I've just spotted you there. Love you very much. Um, let's see. Do, 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 do. <gasps> Green, at those Yule wreaths that you and your Sib made. So lovely. So beautiful. Thank you so much for sharing those. <laughs> you love that. I love that too. <laughs> right. We've got our little uh our little chonky reindeer. I kinda love him. I kinda love him with a little bit of chunk on him. <laughs> I do want it to be more kind of like deer shaped, because I think it might be a little bit dog shaped right now. 95% of nail polish is holographic, it's just my favourite finish nail polish. It's so nice, right? We just all like the shinies. Uh, let me just double check to make sure I haven't missed anybody. Snuck in, still sleepy after late nights. No worries, Green. You know you're cozy and comfy here. Just hang out and enjoy. Psst. My sister used to do proper gel manicure. She gave up offering them as a service. It wasn't popular enough. Equipment was too expensive. Uh, she used to experiment on me. So many siblings who grow nails. Yeah, you do have good nails. Favourite brand of nail polish is Cupcake. Ooh. See, I used to get ones from, uh, there was a little indie brand called uh, Radioactive Unicorn, and they used to do amazing ones. And they're all like horror-based names and all sorts of fun stuff. They were very, very fun. What's my favourite of the fancy nails she used to give me? Nice. I will look forward to seeing some of them, maybe. Uh, Lady Bindor to get a tactical spade, a spear, maybe tear. Yeah, yeah. Um, uh, and a bow. Okay. I mean, yeah, definitely sit with those for a bit and see how they feel. That's an interesting one. Uh, it's fine, it didn't hurt. Every time a nail, see nail tech sees me at work, she asked if I broke my nails yet. <laughs> um, oh, stumbled into and bought some rooms. Yeah. I wore my choker in front of my parents yesterday, didn't make a fuss, I'm going to go choker, invisible lip gloss, pink nail polish, shorts and leggings, all the girly things I can get away with. Yes, Blue V, and you're going to look so good. That sounds like such a look. Sibling was born in Agatha Duke Cross. Had wreaths and loads of dried flowers. Voila. And then I hung about the house. I love that. So nice that you have crafting sessions together. I had... Oh, I don't think I've shown you. How about green? Um, I went pottery painting with my sisters for, um, for our sort of Christmas gathering the other week. 
and I painted a little acorn house cookie jar. It's very cute. Being a friendly neighbourhood, Giles, you got the books. Oh yeah, Paolo Coelho, yeah. I spotted that. When I have my nail polish wish list is bloodhound like a vampire burgundy colour. Ooh. See, I know the holographic would be good, but I know that with burgundies and those deep colours, like, matte effect polish looks so nice sometimes. Like, silky matte. Um... And the spear and shovel are both throwable, so in one is practice with those spears actually buck grade. Oh, wow. Hey, Scruff, how are you doing? Hey, Maisie. Thank you for the look. Merry Christmas to you two. <laughs> Beyond buck grade, ready for a boar charge? Those things are big, though. Sounds very cute. Definitely haven't seen it yet. Yeah, I couldn't remember if I shared it. It hasn't been glazed or fired yet, but I know that when it is, the colours will be a lot brighter. So I'm, I don't know. I might wait. But I did get my bird. Do you remember the bird I did for my birthday? Nude nails with Christmas lights. Ah, oh, I love that crafty. I did. Um, I've got light blue. I've got pictures of me where I had light blue nails, like a light powder blue with Christmas lights painted on. They were very cute as well. Yeah, Merry Christmas to you as well, Scruff. I hope you have a wonderful time. Got the kiddo back from uni as well, so I hope that you all have a wonderful, wonderful Christmas. Ah, oh, thank you for the lurk, Pip. Sixty-seven percent magic. Nice. I love the bird. The bird was very cute. It came out really well, actually, when it's shiny. It's looking a lot more bold. It's very cute. Oh, good beverage for Pip. All the love to you, Pip. Are you working today? Phone's nearly dead. I'll likely be back. No worries, Saf. Thank you so much for spending your time and your phone battery here. It really means a lot. Just prefer for tomorrow, so lurky. No worries. Thank you for the lurk, Scruff. If I don't speak to you before, have a wonderful, wonderful Christmas. Have things to do, so I'm popping out. Happy holidays. Yeah, happy holidays to you too, Drifting. Thank you so much for coming by today. It's really lovely to hang out with you for a little bit. I hope you get everything done nice and quick, and then you can spend the rest of the day relaxing. At work, really not feeling festive this year, distressed. I'm really sorry to hear that, Pip, but I hope that just if you can have us on in the background a little bit, we can send you a little love and a little positive energy. But as I was saying earlier, you know, like... I know it sucks when we don't feel festive, because feeling festive is quite a nice feeling, you know? But I am here to tell you that it is okay if you're not feeling Christmassy. It's okay if you don't want to do Christmas. It's okay if you want to just stay at home and watch trash TV and eat delicious junk food and snuggle up in blankets. That is fine. You should be able to celebrate Christmas in your own way, or not at all. Whatever works for you. Any painted pottery a couple of times in school, so magic, the final reveal. I know, right? It's so lovely, like the place near us, you walk through the place where they um, where they glaze and fire so that you can see everything that's been completed that's ready for collection and you can see all the stuff that is ready to be like glazed and fired and it's so wonderful seeing the process and like the different colours and the ideas and the patterns and things that people have done on their own designs, it's so cool. Uh, ooh! <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Welcome in the coven. I love this. We have the Elder Tree. The Elder Tree has become a character in itself, and I kind of love it. <laughs> Ye who greet us with thy presence shall be welcome in the coven, whether magical or not. Agreed. We are all a little bit magic. Sometimes we don't feel 100% magic, but... You have the, you have the magical, magicalness in you. Uh, I made a dragon back in Ure that Uma still has. I'll get a photo if I remember. Yes, please. <laughs> Apple levels. <laughs> Why are you guys so cute? Everyone in here is just being heckin' adorable. I know we're going to have some arguments that people are like, I'm not adorable. It's like, you can't ever though. <laughs> I feel super festive to be honest, just happy to have a day off. Work retails and you imagine what the past couple of days have been like, yep. I've done my I've done my time in retail, I've done my service. Now you're nasty customers, people told me there was near fights in the other supermarkets. Oh It's meant to be a good time of year and it's just become so challenging for so many reasons, you know? Your dog is adorable. I'm sure that you and your dog are adorable, Huvian. I have no doubt in my mind that you are totally adorbs. I reckon you're a total cutie. <laughs> Did you to get Kosa say ooh on stream next week? Why next week? <laughs> Today I'll accept compliments. Seasonal exception. Plink? 
Uh, I am really, really happy that we got to meet this year. I know that we kind of knew each other through JR's community or other, but I am, I'm really, really happy that we got to spend some time together in the reels this year. I got to get a hug. I got to go to Ikea with a bunch of people who know about overwhelm and stress and when you need a break and don't judge. And I really, really appreciate that. I hope that you had a good time too. Um, and it's a joy having you in here every week to hang out with. And I hope you have a lovely Christmas and a lovely start to your new year. Another year to survive round. Yes. Does it end today or is it Christmas Day? Because if it ends today, then I, I did not ascend to Whamhalla this year. Working retail around the holidays is the worst mistake I ever made. Yeah, I think that everyone in the world should be made to work at least one Christmas in retail. And then everyone would be nice to each other because they know how awful it is. So solidarity and love to all the people out there who are working Christmas in retail because it is tough. Uh, it takes me ages to get a selfie with me and the dog. He fidgets away too much. Oh, but I bet you're so cute though. Asthma's still with me, but I'm okay. Difficult yesterday, it was a damp. I slept better last night. Oh, I'm glad that you slept better, Aflaf. I hope you do feel fully better soon. And you get to have some nice cuddles with Q as well. Hey, Amon. Happy Christmas Eve. How are you doing? Is it almost Christmas Day where you are? Yeah, please join the Discord, Hovian, if you're not in there already. Anyone who's not in the Discord already, come along and join us. It's a lovely, comfy, cozy community. If you want some wholesome content, in between streams then come along and join us love to have you in there hey kayla merry almost christmas merry almost christmas to you too i hope you're having a lovely day today probably enjoying an ad break and carols oh still christmasy for another two hours oh, but we get to celebrate with you in a little bit though i think spicy is it spicy who might be on christmas day already almost made me feel something i'll get there plink i'll get you to feel those feels i'll get your heart to grow three sizes like the grinch <laughs> it's new year's oh so i have to do uwu for new year's is that a thing <laughs> uh nobody in our house has felt all that festive we've all been total grumpa lumps it's just a difficult one off the rough year we've had umar is feeling bad about not getting the festive going reassured her as long as you get to sit in our jammies and have snack and juice, it's all good yes i think we just need to be like are we having a nice time it doesn't need to be are we feeling festive are we feeling Christmassy? are we feeling this that and the other are you surrounded by good people are you having a nice time are all your needs being met like that is the main thing to remember right make sure that all of your needs are being met if you need to take a time out if you need to take a break if you need to just step away from manic family gatherings and stuff and just go and take a walk then absolutely do it do it um but yeah as long as you've got yummy food and lovely people to hang out with and or you know just a, a nice activity to do you could yeah bob got sent i know wham hello yeah <laughs> scottish victory for whamageddon yes you did it crafty black friday cyber money and christmas oh Ella. hey mash how are you doing <gasps> one minute to christmas there we go. We gotta wish Merry Christmas to Spicy. It's officially Christmas for for where she is. Finally, it's the Christmas who's about worried about ascending to Wamhalla. Yes, Merry Christmas, Spicy. So glad we got to be the first peoples to wish you a proper Merry Christmas on the day. Thank you so much for being here, Spicy. I love it when you're here. Uh -huh. Just I've been for, up four nights in a row. Yeah, very much so. There's Bob for Mashashi. Folks, if you're not following Mashashi, please give her a follow. She's lovely. We love her very, very much. Phrases of chalky Vincent and making it again tomorrow. Added strawberries. Oh, <gasps> bloops. That sounds good. I just called you bloops. I kind of like that. <laughs> Notice this game over tradition. Yes, Green. We were talking about traditions the other day. And I was saying how silly they are when you consider, like, you know, there's people I know who are like, we don't really like turkey, but you have to have turkey because it's Christmas. It's like, no, you don't. And they're like, I don't really, you know, like this, that or the other or whatever. But, you know, it's Christmas, so you have to. And it's like, but you don't know if you don't like it, if you're not enjoying it, it's causing you stress and spending and costing you money, but you're not liking it. Why do it? You know, don't participate in shadowed appreciation of those I love. Uh, oh, well done. Uh, but not a Grinch. No, just do the loves. Make sure your needs are met. Agreed. Yes, very much so. Uh, fix my primary set of Denny's and watch on my phone. Yes, Saf. Welcome back. Good to see you in here again. Merry Christmas. 3am on Christmas Eve. Ah, yeah, we are. We're about 
13 hours away? No, you're lovely. No, you are. They ascended this year. Oh, Ayala. But you are drinking with our ancestors in Whamhalla. Down for being bloops. Yeah, I love bloops. Got whammed by Carols by Candlelight. Is it? Does it count, though? Covers and parodies don't count. It has to be the actual wham version, as far as I'm aware. Nutrition is while you were sleeping on Christmas Eve, Muppets Christmas Carol on the day, and Shawshank on Boxer Day. That's a good combo, Tilly. Okay, with turkey bits, expensive. That's true. Decorate my tea on Christmas Eve at 3pm. Festival of Nine Lessons and Carol starts on the radio. Uh, one is in the Discord. You're Suvian. Welcome in. Have a little look around. Hope you like the place. I will be in after stream to greet you properly. Had to be the OG song. Yes. So you might have gotten away with it, Amon. If it was uh, just the parody version. <laughs> you might still be in. Hey, Noofy. Happy Saturday. Oh, goodness. Raiders? <gasps> Pointy Raid. Hello. Welcome in, Raiders. Happy December. I hope you've had a lovely, lovely stream with Pointy. How was it today? I do my proper greets. Welcome in, Raiders. If you've not been here before, I am Cozy and I hope you are too. I am a needle felting streamer from the south of the UK. My pronouns are she, her, they, them. All pronouns and identities and everything are incredibly welcome here. You are massively welcome here. It's so lovely to have you with us today. Uh, we are all about comfy, cozy content, so... Uh, if that sounds like something that you'd be into, please consider hitting the follow button. If not, just hang out, lurk, vibe, chat, do whatever is feeling good to you today. It's wonderful to see you. Hey, Destro! Raid Shadow Legends or something. <laughs> or something. <laughs> traditions are there to connect to the past, and as things change, the traditions morph. Some get forgotten, some are added to or created anew. Shouldn't be set in stone and should definitely be enjoyable. Exactly! It was good. I'm so glad. What were you playing today? Uh, some young people gifted me games and such. We're playing Shadows Over Loathing. Ooh, okay. I'm glad you had a lovely, lovely stream, though. What was the tea today? Did I miss it? Was there a tea? Is it the, was it the green tea that we were talking about the other day? I can't remember if it's a daily tea or a weekly tea. But yeah, folks, if you're not following the pointy one, please do. They're so lovely. I love hanging out with them. They do a lot of morning streams during the week as well. So I uh, quite often lurk in there uh, in the morning when I'm slowly waking up and getting ready for work. And it's a really lovely place to hang out. Big, lovely queer energy in there, which you know I love. So <laughs> daily. <gasps> yes. Yeah. So um, French. Oh, great. Goodness me. That sounds good. Uh, yeah, so all the way through uh, December, um, Pointy's been doing December uh, as their community. Oh, Joy Eileen, welcome in. What a wonderful name. Thank you so much for coming by and thank you for the follow. appreciate that. Um, 4 a.m. coffee, eight, minus 18. Noof. Too cold. Oh, Nightbot's being a pain. Ah, SO the Pointy one. Yeah, that's it. Big queer energy, of course. Need new morning streamers? Yeah, you'll absolutely love Pointy. They're so lovely. Um, but uh, yeah, all the way through December, Pointy and their community have been doing tea December, where they uh, they have different teas each day because not everybody celebrates Christmas, so we're doing tea December, which I love. There we go. Yeah, please go and follow Pointy. We love Pointy very much. Queerlicious. Yep. <laughs> yeah, Joy Eileen, what a wonderful name. Thank you again for the follow. I hope you are all doing wonderful today. If you do need to raid and run, I completely understand. It'd be lovely if you could hang out for a little bit or drop us a follow and come back again another time. I'm here usually Saturdays and Sundays, 10 a.m. to 2 p.m. BST. I'm taking tomorrow off to go and spend time with family and I will be off on New Year's Day. But would anyone like to know what special plans I have for the stream for New Year's Eve? Thank you so much, our queer energy and soul crafting. Yes, you are so welcome in here. If you love those two things, you're going to be happy. Such a cute idea of a tea. I know, right? Uh, we had to change the advert calendar because, oh, too much fennel. It was all December-y fennel. <laughs> but yeah, come on in. I do. It's the Eve of that Christmas things. Um, fairly new. May not have heard of it. <laughs> it is that, yeah, it's that thing, that Christmassy thing, kind of. <laughs> uh, you'd like to hear? Okay, well, I believe... And please correct me if I'm wrong, because there may have been other people that suggested this as well. But I believe that this came from the very lovely Plinkable. 
Everybody give Plinker Ball a wave if you haven't already. He is always up for uh, for pillow fights and pillow forts and snuggles and cuddles and all sorts of things. And he is a lovely, lovely human. Um, I believe that Plink was the one who um, requested slash suggested this. For New Year's Eve, I will not be making something on stream. <laughs> Big huggles, yes. Yeah, the everything tastes like soap tea. Same. Uh, I mean, not everything, but yeah, coriander definitely. Or um, what do you call it in America? Uh, oh, it's on the tip of my tongue. Coriander is begins with a C. Can't remember. Ishka. Uh, yeah, big huggles. We have simple sachets now in a tin. I love that. Oh, I think you showed the tin the other day, right? <laughs> What's it called? Cilantro. That's it. Cilantro. Uh, gotta go. No worries, Pointy. Have a lovely, uh, have a lovely weekend. Whatever you happen to be doing. Um. And it is so, so lovely to see you. Thank you so much for bringing your community over here. I will come and see you again at your next stream. Love you lots. Love to Destro. Love to Minnie. Yeah, there's a lovely plink. Cilantro there. Yeah, that was it. Yeah, vodka, fennel, coriander. Everything tastes like so. Boo. I don't like all of it. Sip, sip, hurry. That was the one. It was so cute. It's going to be so good. Yeah. Love you, Pointy. Love you, Destro. Take care, everyone. Uh, should do. Missed out the family gathering yesterday. I wanted to chill after work. Found it difficult to with my grandparents, especially my grandma was difficult about autism. And was like, autism report? As someone who sets me off. So I haven't seen it. Be seeing Q on Boxing Day with his parents. That sounds lovely. Yeah, I think we're going to have a lot of people who are not really going to be able to understand. And it's not just the autism thing or anything like that. There will be a lot of people out there who are feeling like they're with a group of people who don't really get them. So I hope that you do have your people who do get you that you can go and spend time with and recharge and just know that you are totally valid exactly as you are. You are beautiful and wonderful and I love you millions. We all love you millions. Um, but yes, um, going back to what I'm going to be doing on New Year's. So, New Year's Eve, I will not be making anything on stream. Instead, what I will be doing is uh, Plink's suggestion slash um, uh, request and I will be uh, going through everything that I have made on stream this year. Uh, so if anyone hasn't seen it, if you go here to my Instagram, if you're on Instagram, or you can have a look. I put the photo on Twitter as well. Um, I actually had a rework, a rearrange of my um, uh, of my stream space, which is very small. But I did quite like it because it's nice and cosy. Um, it's very on brand. But I put a photo of it up there and... It made me realise just how many things I've actually made this year. Uh, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to go through them, hopefully in order. I'm going to try and remember which order I made them in. And just talk a little bit about like why I decided to make it, what I like about it, what I would change. Like If any of them need a little bit of a touch-up, we'll give them a little bit of TLC. And then, hopefully in the new year, if all goes well, I will be setting up a little shop. And when it gets to the end of the stream and I've created something, if it's not for a commission, I will be putting it up for sale in the store. Um, but I will have like a minimum price and then it will have a pay what you feel option. So if anybody wanted to donate a little extra, if they wanted to pay a little extra for it, they can. Um, and then I'll be able to make space for some new stuff. But it'll be nice to revisit some of the things that we've been making since February um, and have a proper look at them. So um, let me just catch up here. Nice plan. Yeah, thank you. Um, 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 um. Spend 99% time on my own. I'm always used to it now. I mean, do you feel like you would like some company at some point, Huvian? Or, or are you... Like, it's totally fine if you prefer being by yourself. That is totally valid, too. Yeah, Mon likes it, too, see? <laughs> Just having a little chocolate milk while I scroll back through. I love that photo. It was such a cute little... I was very pleased with that photo, actually. <laughs> The wonderful idea. Oh, I'm glad you like it. Yay. This is so exciting. Yes. I absolutely want to catch that. Yeah. So that will be on, um, I wonder what that was for a second. <laughs> um, there we go. Yeah. You got a little fist bump and an offer of the most comfortable seats in the house. It's pretty good. Uh, she'll be going to my cousin's tomorrow, but she isn't well. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that. I hope she feels better soon. I hope that you can all still hang out. Um, yeah, so the New Year's one will be, at, yeah, New Year's Eve, so next Saturday. Uh, um, but I will not be streaming on Christmas Day tomorrow or New Year's Day next Sunday. 
but then when we go into the new year I'll be back on Saturdays and Sundays 10am to 2pm uh, 2 UK time. But I hope that you all still have a lovely lovely holiday and this is our little bit of time to spend together. So if anybody's celebrating today, anyone uh, in Europe as we were saying before, anybody celebrating New Year, um, Christmas Eve, I hope you're having a wonderful day with the with your loved ones. This year's COVID still be coming over for Christmas. I don't really know what to do about that. Hmm. Have you had a chance to talk to her about your concerns, Bloops? We have to see when Healy and Jerry are available. We may be able to do something with Hannah as I spend a lot of time talking to her. We will see. That's okay. Don't you worry about that. If you can make it here, you are appreciated. If you can't make it here because you've got other plans, completely understandable. Check your Instagram for items you made this year. That's how I see what I've made and when. Yes. Well, I think because a lot of them are on my YouTube, exclamation point YouTube, if you're not already on there, I'd really appreciate uh, subscribing. It is uh, completely free, but it really does help me out. Um, I put time lapses of everything on there. I know I've missed a couple from the beginning of the year because it was before I started editing the videos and putting them up. And some of them expired on, on Twitch before I could download them. Because I was still learning at that point. Uh, but most of them are on there, I think. And the last time I checked, Lovely Arkansas the Otter was the most popular video on there. <laughs> so, lovely, lovely Arkansas in there. You can see him being made. Batman the Hatches leave a tray out food. Yeah, exactly. You're not coming in, but you can have some yummy food. Bye. <laughs> But yeah, that is a really good idea, Noof. <laughs> uh, get frustrated when people insist on mingling if they just have sniffles. Yeah, it's true. I mean, there are a lot of, you know, we know a lot of people in our community and a lot of people uh, around who have, um, you know, like, uh, like autoimmune issues and things like that, which can cause some real issues. Thank you for the frost spell, Mama Lee. How are we doing? Happy Christmas Eve. Love you lots. Not yet. The family isn't the most understanding. Best we'll be able to do is try and keep my distance. Yeah. Um, I think Iman was feeling the same. That she was, uh, like, uh, being invited to a wedding. And it was like, I'm going to be wearing a mask. Regardless of what you say. And that is totally fine. Uh, we're not going to get into discussions about those sorts of things. It is what you feel comfortable with. There are still people getting ill in, out there. And you have your own reasons for um, how you feel about that. And what you do to act on it. You know? We're not going to get into a big discussion because I think we've had that the uh, <laughs> I think we've had that discussed at great length over the past two years, and it can get quite sort of political and heated and stuff. And that is not the vibe we want here. We want lovely, comfy, cozy, festive vibes. So I hope that you feel better. I have no issue with people letting us know that that is what they're they're dealing with, but we don't want to get into a, a little. Uh, political discussion about that sort of thing <laughs> hope it doesn't stress you out and still enjoy the day yes i really hope it does we love you lots bloops just waking up gonna be working at the convenience store team leader felt pressure because the store would need to close if she didn't oh no 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 don't worry bloops no honestly they talking about your situation and the fact that it is affecting all of us still um that is totally fine it was more because i think i realized that i'd mentioned about like wearing masks in public and stuff and that is still sort of a hot button issue it's still uh you know people are very um polarized about it so i just didn't want to get into that angle of the conversation you know uh yeah good morning good morning uh holy shoot drew runes to confirm who is calling to me pull three and zeus which is odin yep uh the spear of tear and the wheel there you go. See? Appa just brought me a sock. Oh, Appa, what a gift. What a beautiful gift. But yeah, Bloops, we always want to know what is going on with you and how you're feeling and what you're doing and all of that lovely stuff because we love you very, very much. I just wanted to make sure that it wasn't making anybody any uh, uncomfortable or we didn't sort of get into a big discussion about the mask things. Yeah. Hard to go anyway, I don't so much notice whether people still wear masks or not. Yeah, I mean, I still see a lot of people around. And like I said, I'm I'm fully whatever is making people feel comfortable and whatever makes me comfortable. In-laws are here, must come from the humans disguising go and be normal. Yeah. Good luck with that, Law. <laughs> Give that a try, see how it goes, yeah. Those are holidays do tend to be when I got called by way too many deities, yeah. It's it's that time, I believe. Like, you know, obviously we have like Samhain, which is like um uh the veil is thin, 
and uh, you you are sort of closer to spirits and things. But when you think about deities and like how many how many different belief systems and religions and things like that kind of converge on this time of year, and it makes sense that like that would we would be open to more of those vibes, you know. Show them all my normal trophies. Ah. <laughs> Laura's the best at normal. Laura's totally, totally normal. Hey, Emery, how are you doing? Wish I had Ari's innocence this time of year. She loves Christmas, obviously. I hate it. Resellers ruined it. Yeah, I know how that feels. Um, I know how that feels, Emery. I hope that you can have a good time, whether it's a festive time or not. But I hope that you can have a good time and just remember that you do deserve rest and delicious foods and spending time with your loved ones. And we love you very much, Emery. Just saying that. Normal's a social construct creator for selling products. Yes. <laughs> Uh, definitely feeling drawn to Tyr and Athena. Continue to keep your respectful distance and occasional contact with Odin. Yeah, I mean you do play with tricksters, so, and he is he is quite the trickster. So, <laughs> good luck with the normaling. I mean, yeah, you're gonna need the good luck with the normaling. <laughs> Loris is gonna be a normal as they are typing. Lady Lee, calling out law like that. Tried making paragon thingies, bracelets, key tags, lanyards, and monkey f monkey fists. The last couple of mornings, so nice to see the difference in the first one compared to the last one. I love that. This is why I enjoy. Like I'm looking forward to looking back at some of the things I've made and seeing some of the um the bits that I want to try, uh, and if they if I can see an improvement in what I'm doing or whether I want to sort of take it a different way. It means I bet yeah, Laura is totally the best. Do you have to what spend time with loved ones? Well, I mean, you don't have to, Emery, but you do have, like, some loved ones built right in there, which is uh, quite a wonderful thing, I think. I hope that you have some some good times together within the system, at least, you know? The normaling, yeah. <laughs> By M. Night Shyamalan, yeah. It's just, like, everyone trying to be normal. That'd be quite terrifying, actually. Main thing I want to do is something I can do alone so it shouldn't ruin everything. I'm going to be playing a game called Chicory. Ooh, that sounds fun. Have enough trick tests between Dionysus and Hermes. Yeah, don't remember their name for 20 seconds. The only word I was thinking of was Daddy. <gasps> yeah, that sounds about right. <laughs> See, I don't have much of a um, much of a connection to like the pantheons and things like that. I'm very much like self, I guess. But yeah. Maybe I'll look at some people that who I feel drawn to to work with. Sounds great. Not heard of Chicory. I know. That's. I mean, the name itself. <laughs> the Elder Tree saying no move. <laughs> kind of like they live. Yeah, we're just like everyone's normal. And then you wear. Then you're Roddy Piper and you wear the glasses and then everything's not normal. <laughs> wow, it's been a while since I've watched They Live. I don't know what the heck this is going to end up being right. I'm going to take my little brush, my little brush mat. Where's the little one? There it is. There it is. Let's try that instead. <laughs> the office forgot to remove my rent from check, so next week I have a CNC router being delivered. Oh, okay. I mean, hopefully you don't get caught out for that, Noof, but yeah, treat yourself. Also, I don't know what the person in the system said that they go to church with the parents. I'm pissed I haven't set foot in church for three years. I mean, is it mass? Are you going to be there for hours or could you duck out a little bit? Protection spell. Thank you, Saf. Appreciate you. Luffy's on number five. That sounds about right for the coffees. Uh, see a street, sort of like Desperate Housewives in the dark looming presence lurking in the background. Oh, Desperate Housewives Street is great. Because at least one of the houses is... Um, the Monsters House. It's on like the Universal Studios lot, which is why I love that street. And it's so like Stepford. It's so good. I'm a five at four twenty. Nice. <laughs> Goodness. I mean, I did get caffeinated. I don't drink coffee, but I did get mildly caffeinated while I was at work the other day, and, and magically managed to get quite a lot of work done. So, could be something in this caffeine thing. We should probably keep an eye on it. <laughs> Could you hide and let someone else trump for that? I mean, I don't know if it. I, I I don't know enough about it to know whether that would be an option, but hopefully, yeah. So I mean, it, someone agreed to it. So hopefully, that means that they wanted to be at the event. So 
hopefully they will then front for that and it will be more comfortable again i apologize if i have the the process incorrect it's still something that i'm learning about so imagine that the elder tree works with me now as the leader of the nature beings i love that aflav i love that so much let's do that that's canon now uh, remember you always change your mind if people are frustrated you don't owe them to do something if you're comfortable exactly you can say if if it is you you can be like do you know what just not feeling it today uh recommended chicory is a game about the journey of being an artist and dealing with imposter syndrome also basically a coloring book one of the things i've asked for is the precious sensitive stylus for my switch you're also using tri chicory uh, favourite composer, Lena Rain, worked on the game. She's a transform composer that works on Celeste and Minecraft. Oh, I love that. Hey, Mango. No, you're not late. You arrived just in time. How are you doing today? Going gross in a comic I was reading. Oh, I love that. I hope you had a lovely time reading your comic. I hope you are enjoying it very much. It's good to see you in here. Oh, for, uh, that's your property. If not comfortable in church, it's all good. Yeah. No one should ever be pressured into doing things that they feel uncomfortable with because it's Christmas. The amount of times you hear people, oh, come on, it's Christmas. And it's like, well, no, just, I don't know. I'm feeling a bit more defensive about these things now. And like, I, I am very much more protective of my energies and stuff because I know how draining these things can be. So just a chain smoker used to smoke in the church bathroom. <gasps> you rebel, Emery, I like you. I love everything about it. It sounds good, right? It's really good. I came straight here after I finished. Aw, oh, Mango. I'm really glad you enjoyed it. If you feel like sharing it, just stick it in the um in the geek out section on the Discord. Exactly. Wizard is never late. <laughs> Nor is he early. He arrives precisely when he means to. Ran out of sugar three days ago. You're just still drinking coffee? Or do you not have coffee? Uh, need a coffee sweetener? Try without first. Not for me. Open the pantry. Pancake syrup. Buttery flavour. Maple. <gasps> I mean, there's plenty of stuff that you can add to a coffee, but I mean, I don't even like coffee, but those sound kind of good. Yeah, and how hard it is to replace your energy once it's been depleted. Yeah. It's like, it goes quickly, but you need a lot of time to recharge. And I know that I've got, you know, like... I've got tomorrow and I've got tomorrow and Boxing Day. Um, that's the 26th for anyone who doesn't celebrate Boxing Day. Um, yeah, so I've got tomorrow and the 26th uh, with family. I've got the 27th to recover and then I've got the 28th with my very large family. So I know that I've got a... Taki Rosh, Merry Christmas. Welcome in. Merry Christmas to you too. I hope you're having a lovely day today. Thank you so much for coming by. Um... Yeah, so I know that I've got that day in between to recover, and then I've got... Witchy Craft! Yes! Did we just become best friends? I think so. Thank you so much for the follow. Appreciate it. Hope you're having a great day today. Uh, have a do and juice to you. Ooh, yes. There's a Tumblr account comic I was reading, and I shared the dedicated account. It's actually a fan comic. Yes, I have a webcomic that I read, like, permanently, so... You <laughs> probably, we're just best buddies now. How you doing, Witchycraft? Are you a streamer? If you are, let us know. We'd love to shout you out. Come and hang out in your community too. Uh, weather is treacherous at the moment, so I called off work. Ooh, whereabouts are you in the world? You are, it was right worth. Ooh, oh, okay. Now I know. <laughs> uh, yeah, can we go and shout out for Witchycraft, please? What a name. Perfect. Pressure in the culture is the very reason I'm avoiding Christmas year. It's self-care. It is. Plan to celebrate next year. Going to be out mingling in some special punk battle gear, the red gearing patches, bells, anti-indoctrination, anti-corporate themes. Saf, some of the stuff that you've done already that, you, that I've seen is incredible. So, uh, yeah. I'm uh, very, very excited to see, like, yeah, the anti-Christmas, anti-establishment. <sighs> Crafting and gaming and Photoshop. <gasps> I want to come and hang out. That sounds fun. I will give you a follow after stream, Witchy Craft, and come and check out your streams. I'm looking forward to meeting you properly. Northern Midwestern, Midwestern US, right near the Great Lakes, specifically Michigan. Ah, yeah, we have uh, we have a lovely buddy in here. Lee, are you about Mama Lee? Mama Lee's from uh, from Pennsylvania. Uh, we have a few people who are from uh, sort of like North Midwest areas and i know that you guys have not got the best weather at the moment so lots of love and safety and all the good vibes to you 
Hey Kiri, welcome in. How you doing? I hope you're having a lovely day today. <laughs> yup, yup. Yeah, Lady Lee is, is chilling. She went and uh, checked out to make sure that her duckies that she has in her amazing menagerie of beautiful animals, uh, that they were all uh, warm and safe and the heat lamp is working. So everybody is nice and... Yes. Not anti-Christmas. Okay. I will use... Uh... Yeah, anti anti establishment. Do, do do one second. I have a bunch of uh, reference pictures. Very happy. I was worried for them. Oh, but I, they're okay, right? Lake effect snow. Oof. Yeah, I can't imagine how chilly that would be. We we had you know like fairly chilly. Over here in the UK, I'm in the south of the UK for anyone who um, who is not sure where I am in the world. Uh, experimenting with my camera to see what it might be like if I showed more than my arms. If you can see me, you can't see what I'm doing woven design wise. Oh, could you, I'm guessing it would be either have to be higher or zoomed out a bit, but then it depends on the space. Just read a message to Ari. Whoops. Hey Andy, about to go to sleep. Wanted to pop by and say hello. Merry almost Christmas to you, Andy. I hope you have a wonderful, wonderful day. Thank you so much for coming by. Get some good sleeps and have a lovely, lovely Christmas. We'll see you soon. To read a message to Ari so the system's that's complicated. Uh, Sky, how's you? Merry Christmas. I'm so excited. It's talking to you again, big sis Sky. Yes, I saw Ari was posting about um, like defending Sky earlier. I think. Definitely avoiding swear words or disturbing imagery beyond the occasional skull. One thing I like about Christmas is the happy kids. Agreed. Very much so. Uh, Steampunk AU and Phoenix was a mechanic while Miles was an engineer. Slow build up to the confession and kiss scene. Felt myself burn up. Woohoo! Good fluff. Fluff is good. It's about 12 degrees. Ooh, yeah, it's 8 degrees and cloudy here, apparently. My first project with the CNC machine will be making a small IOU sign to give to the office. Be like... <laughs> You didn't take my rent, I owe you the rent. <laughs> didn't get much for snow, you did get ice and cold. Yeah, stay warm and safe, everybody. Night, night, Andy, we love you very much. Oh, thank you for that ban. Our flat, appreciate you. Little bot ban. Yesterday was around minus 13 with wind chills of minus 23. Oof. City bus services were called up a couple of hours after I got home. We were expecting one to two feet of snow overnight. Wind is whipping snow from the ground into a blizzard with zero visibility. Oosh. Please stay safe. All the love to you and yours during this freaky weather that's going on. Um, yeah, we definitely need to be... This is not the right shape, Cozy. Come on now. Um, yeah, we definitely need to be sending all the love to the folks who are being affected by storms and all sorts of things at this time of year. Uh, yeah, not happy. Well, Sky's not happy. We should be fine. I'm glad to hear it. Make sure you keep us updated. Let us know how you're doing. We'll pop in. Come and see you when you're live. Minus 45. <sighs> Goodness. We have 9 degrees. Sunny and a gentle breeze. Stark contrast to minus 7 and ice. Yeah, true. I mean, we were saying. We were like... You know, like a week ago. Or a week and a bit ago. We were like... Minus temperatures. Absolutely freezing cold. Everybody like genuinely concerned. And now we're just like... Hey, we're just hanging out. Minus 19. God. All over in the UK had a cold snap recently. Some friends from Cornwall were saying it was hella cold. Yes, it was very chilly, but no, nothing compared to to minus thirteen and minus twenty three feel. Yeesh. Ariana isn't happy. Oh no, I don't like it when Ariana isn't happy. I don't like when anyone isn't happy. This ear is far too big, far too big. Right. Anyone comes in here who actually knows what they're doing with felting is going to be frowning at me right now, but needs must. Spent a silly amount keeping warm. Yeah, we've just been piled under blankets and things mostly. Wind chill minus 26. Oosh. Uh, now that I know which isn't just a quirky name for you, wasn't so sure, uh, I'll let you know that one of the patches on my skirt is enchanted. It has a bay leaf under it with the word endurance and a bloodstone tumblestone. Yes! I love that, Saf. And yes, uh, I don't I don't talk about my practices all that much because um, for me they're quite personal. Um, but yeah, I I uh, I have my own my own stuff going on and just open to 
all of those kinds of things, I guess. And, and I'm kind of eclectic as well, which a lot of people think is, you know. But I'm eclectic in all things. I'm eclectic in my gender, my sexuality, and my witchcraft practice, apparently. So, why not? Uh, our cold snap was minus eight. Couldn't live anywhere that was that cold all the time. Yeah, it's cold. Thank you, Aflaf. I appreciate you keeping us safe. Do you guys dislike warm or cold the most? I dislike warm, because I can warm myself up more than I can cool myself down. There's a limit to how much you can cool yourself down. As you can't needle felt allergic to sheep's wool. Witchy craft. Would it interest you to know that I have never used sheep's wool in this stream, ever? Uh, I don't like using animal products. I have no issue with anybody using them, but it's just not for me. I'm vegan and I would prefer to use acrylic. And that is what I use entirely. So, um, yeah, it is possible. <laughs> Gas and electric is about 200 a month for a one bedroom ground floor flat. Hoovian. Um, apparently minus six, wind chill minus nine, dew point of minus 17, 29 wind chill, minus 29 wind chill. Ugh. Dislike heat wave. Yeah, exactly. I dislike the heat wave. Um, are we the same person? Possibly witchycraft. What practices? Um, a witchcraft. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Uh, practice a little bit to connect to my ancestors. That's lovely. Let's see, uh, yeah, I heard that only wool could have felt properly. Yeah, so, um, what I'm doing next week, Witchy Craft, um, this time next week, um, is I will be, instead of making something, I will be showing all of the things that I've made this year so far. So I started streaming in February of this year, so we've got almost a year's worth of stuff. Um, and it'll be interesting to see some of the bits and find out which is everyone's favourites and all those things. Um, but yeah, every single piece in here has been made with chunky acrylic wool um, because I wanted to see if it could and it worked because it was the one thing that was keeping me away from it. And so I started trying needle felting in January of this year and then decided to start streaming it in February. So parents have to pay uh, 10,000 uh, 10, krona. Oof. That sounds like a lot. Hey, Jess. Christmas Eve has started over here. I want to wish you all the happiest holidays. Hoping we may celebrate. Lots of love to you, Jess. Thank you so much for coming by. I hope you have a wonderful, wonderful Christmas. A wonderful celebration and time with all your favourite peoples. Go from minus 10 to 22 degrees in 37.5 seconds when I fire up the torpedo. 80,000 BTU fan force diesel heater. Four pens to make. Pen and pencil set. Fountain pen and Parker pen set. Both cherry. Oh, I can't wait to see them. But that does sound warm. <laughs> let to let my phone charge. No worries, Bloop. See you soon. Cannot find my spare glasses. Are they are they on your face, Kiri? That's sometimes what happens to me. That's seven hundred and forty pounds a month. Whoosh. Been streaming for five years, but took most of the year off for some very big reasons. Only went live four or five times this year. And you know what, Witchycraft? That is absolutely fine. I appreciate you for taking time off for things that you needed to do. There's a lot of people who feel like, you know, wrongly feel like they're letting people down by not streaming. When really, all we want you to do is to make sure that you're looking after yourself. And I hope that some of those big things, um, I hope that, number one, I hope that they were good big things in a way. But if they weren't, um, I hope that you have found um, some solutions and some peace and some positivity out of it. And I hope that we do get to see you streaming soon, because I'm going to be following you and keeping those notifications on. So that when you do go live, if you do go live, I get to come and meet you for reals. Yeah, 10,000 Swedish Corona is £787. That's wild. That is, it's just bananas. With that, I will lurk. Going to get dressed and do chores. Work on more greeting commands off stream. Volume is on. Just shout my name. No worries, Aflaf. Love you lots. <laughs> Drown the witch. Welcome in. How are you doing today? Average viewership actually didn't suffer much. See? Yeah. That's it. You just got... If you've got, like, a lovely community of people, then it works, you know? It's okay. I'm going to see whether this will work with the ear. I should just... I should have actually made my other one. Wait. We'll do that first. 25% magic for Lady Lee. 60% magic for Drown the Witch. There's a lot of magic. That is a lot of magic. You are clearly magical. Yeah, forget my glasses are on my face. I do the same. I walk around looking for my phone while I'm carrying my phone. <gasps> oh, you got a package for Christmas gifts? Ooh, Emery, what you got? You are way more magic than that. No worries, Green. Thank you for the lurk. Love you lots. 
you feel like that today. I'm sorry you feel like that, Emery. I hope you feel better soon. I hope we're helping a little bit at least. Hmm. I mean, I guess you like it here, Emery, because you keep coming back, and I'm so glad you do. Uh, here's the genius recipe for happy chai tea with cardamom, evaporated milk, and Bailey's. Ooh, hello. Uh, I did. I have had it uh, recommend, not recommended to me, but suggested to me a few times. I don't know if anyone's actually tried it, but there is a vegan eggnog out there. You are, and we got socks. <gasps> I love socks. Socks are good. Electricity bills are surging, especially for people in houses due to the current situation in Europe. Yeah, it's wild out there. So I hope that you are able to stay safe and warm and, you know, fed and keep the roof over your head and everything like that. I hope that you are, that you've got everything that you need um, out there. And, you know, don't bankrupt yourself trying to buy gifts for people when you need to be looking after yourself first. Mum got a friggin' llama wall decoration. Oh, can I see, Mango? Please post pictures. You know, I love to see pictures. Uh, funny quotes about my day of fit relationships. I'm a follower of Dionysus that does not like wine, and a follower of Hermes who doesn't ride a bike, drive a car, ride a motorcycle, or otherwise use modern roads in the literal sense of the most arts. None of mind. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> like I said, I, I haven't, I haven't picked, I haven't, um, really found, like, anyone that like I, I sort of vibe with but I guess if I haven't been like open to um, like connecting with uh, with deities and things then you know I need to be open to that right uh, post it later no worries mango uh, right so witchy craft number one we are so glad you're here with us no trauma dump no nope. No such thing as a trauma dump. We are an open community. Um, if there's anything that does trigger someone from uh, from what's being talked about, obviously we then ask if it can be moved to the Discord. But otherwise, if you've got stuff to share and you feel comfortable sharing it with here, I'm so, so grateful and appreciate that, that you're comfortable and open enough to share. So... No trauma dump, it's all solved. Living in an apartment with terrible people upstairs for six months, spending every day of those six months triggered, every night not sleeping, so they kept their radio so loud I could Google the lyrics. That and I lost two family members last January to COVID. I'm in a better, bigger apartment now in a better area. So I am so, so glad that um, you're out of that situation because that sounds horrible. Um, those people uh, do not sound like good people at all. And I'm really, really sorry that you had to go through that. But the main thing to remember is that you you went through it. You got out the other side. You are now in a better situation. I am so, so sorry for your loss um, this year. Uh, I hope that you can honour their memory. And they'll never truly be forgotten as long as you keep speaking their name, sharing stories, laughing, remembering them. And uh, they'll always be with you in, a, in, in many, many ways. So lots of love to you. And I'm so glad that you're starting the new year in a brighter place than you did, um, than you had before. I'm so grateful that you're here with us now. View is simple. You're nice to me, I'm nice to you. Yeah, Mary, you all okay? How are you doing? Your blessings to you. I hope you're having a wonderful day, but I had to go a little crazy first, but yes, we're better. That's good. But sometimes we have to go through the hard stuff to come out the other side, yes? And if you accept hugs, uh, uh, witchy craft, there will be lots of hugs for you. <laughs> but we always ask first. The thing is, deities are much more nuanced than the public perception. They also change with the times. It's also about staying relevant. Dinos is more than happy for me to share an energy drink. Hermes has become an internet god. Vulcan and Hephaestus have evolved their craft affinity to include robotics and computer hardware. Yeah, see, they evolve. It's amazing. Oh, Emery, I can't wait to see the socks. I'm excited. Just come 5.40 a.m. You are you are here. You have coffee. And we're good. To, we're glad to hang out with you, Kate. And MSG3K is the best. JR returns. Welcome back, JR. Where were you? I don't want to ask. That's that's not my business. And link an Instagram picture. Um, Show you what I like to do live. If you pop your Instagram name rather than the full link because we have it set up so only VIPs and mods can share links just to make sure that everyone's safe and we don't have any sort of random links um, being posted in stream. Not that you would, of course. But if you pop your um, your username in there, um, then I will be more than happy to come and give you a little follow. My socials are down here as well. Uh, and I will come and check out what you're working on. 
And I'd love to see what you're doing live. It is that one cereal tonight. It's now crackle pop. <laughs> so you went to get wrapping paper. Ah, yes, of course. And you got yourself a present. Ooh. Or you can whisper it, Witchycraft. Oh, no, it's fine. Um, if you... Uh, who have we got in? Got anybody in right now? We got Law? Is Law here? You got a grilling machine? Nice. Like a George Foreman-y type one? Like a... Like a press? There we go. Thank you, Aflaf. I knew you were lurking. <laughs> that one. Nice. Awesome. So you can make toasties. I'm looking forward to seeing Emery's socks. Uh, war deity is a lot less conventionally warlike. Nah, universally encouraging ever readiness, self improvement. Yeah. So all the good, all the, you know, quote unquote good uh, sides of things is like, yeah, learning about like preparedness and stuff. That makes so much sense, doesn't it? Often easy to mistake as anti war. It's more like wanting to end wars quickly and efficiently. Yeah. Like the Dutch grilling experience, gourmetten. Ooh. Uh, witchy.craft.tv there we go folks if you could do me a favor and go and check out and go and give uh, the lovely our new friend witchycraft a little follow on twitch and a little follow on instagram and go and check out what they're doing i would love that and i will be doing the same after stream first my legs from sitting and art vomiting and now my back and arms mango uh someone who has the uh someone who has the channel points would you do me a favor and uh, redeem the stretch for me. There we go. Thank you. Nurgle for one guides me on the political battlefield and encourages peaceful solutions to altercations. And that sounds like a great thing. Nurgle just reminds me of 40k though. And that's a different Nurgle. <laughs> that's a very different Nurgle. Thank you, JR. I appreciate you. Right, so Mango especially, but everybody else. If you could join me in a stretch if you feel so inclined and if your body is allowing you to today because stretching feels good just have a long little stretch give your fingers a wiggle as well feels good <clears throat> get my head why am i in your head i asked for the stretch to be redeemed right picture that lord after share for me is a side by side of the same doll <gasps> i can't wait to see i'm excited Returns, now I can have multiple Twitch tabs open. Welcome back, Meredith. Uh, and the picture. Thank you so much, Afla. Could you DM that to me? I'd really appreciate that, Afla. I'm going to have a little drinky while I'm here, too. He is a god of pestilence. There's so much more. Uh, Nirgal. Okay. That makes sense. You think of Cavill doing a 40k series on Amazon. I think he would actually do really, really, really good because he is, like, obsessed with the source material. I do also think that they should have uh, WWE wrestler Shayna Baszler as a character in it because she is a total uh, Warhammer nerd as well, and I think she could do a really, really good job of it. Um, may this... Oh, yay! So, if you are new here, this is the Jar of Stars. Um, drop me a message from mod chat. Thank you so much, Aflaf. I appreciate you. Uh, let me sh make sure I've got everybody there. Right, uh, Emery, do you have a colour um, preference, my love? If not, I will pick one for you. Gonna go make breakfast nearly really fast, need coffee? No worries. I'll be going on a break in about 15 minutes anyway, but I hope you have a lovely coffee and we'll see you again in a bit. And wherever I want it that way. <laughs> I'm not singing Mango, but uh, my, my my voice will not let me sing, but I am hearing it in my head. May this new year be a year where Emery becomes a nicer person and full of happiness. I I say that you are. Yeah, it's purple. Good choice. What a wonderful choice. That's black. That's the wrong colour. I can't see what the colour of that's blue. Purple. Perfect. Uh, not produced you're right yep <laughs> but now uh yeah if we haven't had a shout out for the lovely jared plays games already please go and give him a follow he's an absolute sweetie he's one of my favorite people i love him to bits um and uh we ooh, he's uh he's actually changed his shift uh his stream times so he's now 7 p.m till 10 p.m mondays to wednesdays 
instead of the uh, previous 11 till 11 p.m. to um, 8 p.m. to 11 p.m. Sorry, words. Um, if you could give them a follow, I'd really, really appreciate it. You'll usually find me hanging out in there as well, uh, as long as uh, as well as uh, several people uh, in our blended community, which I love very much. Um, but yeah, he's he's now on earlier as well, which hopefully should give you an extra hour in the evening, JR, to um, consume some content. <laughs> Catch up. No good, no good differentiation is just the kind of thing he likes. It's all about pick your battles. Uh, last thing he would want is to argue against the comparison. That's that's true. I like that. we got to talk about this more at some point. Uh, you know, I said I was going to graze to the damn pigs in blankets. Might have just sat and ate the whole lot. Hoovian. I mean, that's kind of heroic. I kind of love that for you. <laughs> hope you enjoy right i'm gonna do this jar of stars so anybody who's new in here first things welcome we're so glad you're here every single star in here has been donated by a member of the community over the past year or the past few months however long i've had this going for every single one has a lovely positive message um just words of kindness and good things chosen by them and redeemed with their channel points they pick a color they pick the words i write them it goes in the jar so, I'm going to catch up with the chat in a second once I finish this one for the lovely Emery. So, it is May this New Year be a year where Emery. I already think you're a nice person, Emery. Just saying. Uh, becomes <laughs> I gotta make it small now <laughs> becomes a nicer person or oh, I could fit it in and full of oh no hold on I got it ha be mess yay happiness Woo I did it <laughs> just about fit it in there you're testing me Emery I love it Juice, just being a fanboy. Yeah, total fanboy. I'm fine with that. Uh, yeah, please don't follow. Yeah, that's not gonna happen. What's not gonna happen? What? Watching content. Merry Christmas Eve. Hey, Samaya. How are you doing? Merry Christmas Eve to you. Hope you're having a lovely day. That is a very, very cute emote as well. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that little puddin'. Did you see the picture of my sister's DS's community? I did. I think I reacted to it. I was very excited. I didn't know that was to happen. That was a happen. I didn't know what words they were. But yes, Emery, thank you so much for redeeming your star. I hope that the following year is a wonderful year for you and for everyone. I hope that you uh, make some good discoveries about yourself and how wonderful you are. And I hope that you have your boundaries set and you're kind to yourself because that is where it starts from we have to make sure that we are kind to ourselves first it sounds selfish it sounds self-centered and we are taught that we shouldn't be doing that but you have to work on yourself first so that you can be there and show up for the people that you love there's a little star thank you so much for that one emery i love you <laughs> yeah i didn't know i didn't know that they were backs compatible either mango i was very excited to see that there's probably some gaming nerds being like, what now? <laughs> uh, Tyr is going to be interesting to explore a relationship with. I'm familiar with the War God archetype. His energy is so different. It's intriguing and exciting. Yeah, I mean, I only know Tyr from, um, like, the sort of the Norse stories and stuff. He was a very brave boy. He was a good one. So, yeah, I'm interested to see sort of how that now sort of diverges into, um, like... Uh, modern kind of thinking, I guess. Twitch broke on me there. Oh no, gravity face! Boo! I'm doing okay. He's very cute. His name is Buzzby and he's a cute Grimace bee. Ooh. And a snow bee and a pud bee. That's gorgeous. Yes, Kate. That is one of my favourite things. Yeah. Yeah, I'll tell you that every time. Put your oxygen mask on first. Make sure that you have everything that you need before you start looking after the needs of others. And it means that you are more likely to be able to help the people that you love and that you care about by making sure that you have everything that you need first. 
It's it sounds like a backwards way of doing it because we've been told it's a backwards way of doing it. It's not though. It makes sense. So make sure that you are looking after yourself first because you totally deserve it. Want to be nicer to the systems? Um, broke it off with broke it off with your girlfriend for a friendship. I mean that's a really really mature thing to do, um, Emery. Ten out of ten star is a good one. The kiddies are way too wired. They're excited for Christmas. According to Encyclopedia Britannica, which finds to be a brilliant source on deities. Oh, really? Uh, apparently the god concerned with the formalities of war and treaties and justice. That makes sense. Obviously, it must be broke for a while. I don't know. But, and that does resonate. That's good. You remind me that you have savings and extra money in the bank for a reason, JR. You have been, um, I know that you've had times like we all have in our past where we have uh, been a little bit overspendy but money comes and goes you have enough to make sure that you can live comfortably and pay your bills and we do tend to overspend a little bit at this time of year however you are going to be fine you've got more than enough to make sure that you are tidied, tidied over and you've got enough to cover like any you know emergencies or unexpected spends and stuff that come up you are going to be fine and i will make sure of it okay oh we have dad jokes oh my god <laughs> oh wow Afla, that's amazing thank you <laughs> i have mice and the kitty is on my lap no mice in my place just the neighbors upstairs and next door hey paracord pete how are you doing I hope you're having a lovely weekend. Uh, and if you don't take care of yourself, how can you take care of others? And when you're giving your all to others, where do you draw the line? Yes. You cannot pour from an empty cup. You need to make sure that you have what you need first. Even if it's just the basics, even if it's just those little things, but you need to have those before you start giving out your energy to other people. Please, please, please remember this. It is vital. It is like the main thing that you need to be remembering. Uh, yeah, everyone does. Hey, Maggie! How you doing, my love? Uh, Kaiser is trying so hard to be with her art remote. She's the system's swim flame. Yeah. But, if you feel that that is the, the right decision for everyone concerned, Emery, then you've done the amazing mature thing, and I'm incredibly proud of you for that, because it must have been a hard decision to make. Learn to buy a day in my game and don't have to steal my DS, my sister DS light. Yeah, I have a DS light. It does a floodgate. Yeah, we might have to put a timer on that one. <laughs> Make sure we don't get a million dad jokes, but we do good. Expect any company to recharge, but it's not that easy. Just got to... Uh... I think at this time of year, a lot of people are very, very busy, but New Year could be like New Year, new plan. We're going to meet up and hang out a little bit more and all of that kind of stuff. Yeah, does that sound good? doing okay thank you for asking how are you doing i am doing very well pete i am enjoying hanging out with this wonderful lot and we're all feeling varying degrees of festive which is totally fine we're just using it to spend time together really reading the ginger air and adding pink it's big fatigue today got stuff to do drinking coffee at the moment taking it slow taking it slow is a very good idea meggie but please share pictures of the hair the hair sounds good Do definitely feeling better so that's right that's good emery like i said i know it must have been a hard decision to make and it may not be agreed with across the entire system but it sounds like it was the right decision and you get to still have this amazing person in your life um and sometimes friendship is the is the way to go about that <laughs> it was the best present someone can get a broke drum no one can beat that <laughs> According to Mythopedia, Tyr was the Norse god of war and bloodshed, also renowned as a bringer of order and justice. Yeah, he sacrificed his hand for it. Yeah, sacrificed his arm to Fenrir, yeah. Literally so that he was just like, this is what I need to do. Scary similarity with these behaviours and recent events in my life, I'll martyred him aspect, the idea of peace at any cost. It feels like core. Cool. Yeah. And that might be why you've got that connection there. That's amazing, though. And, like, the fact that you know yourself that well as, uh, as well, Saf, is an awesome thing. That you can see those connections between him and you because you're like, I feel that in myself. That means that you know yourself well, and that is such an important thing to do as well. Know yourself. Um, 
I just need to take my bed sheets off to wash them with two cats sleep on the bed. How many cats do you have, Meggie? I thought for some reason you only had Ginge. Hope next year is better. Didn't realise the thought about it, how horrid this year was. It means I was an awesome pilot for most of the year. Yeah. Cutie snoozing. Mm. An entire sense I call Tira God that represents my night aspect. Yeah, wanting to come in and, you know, sort things out for people, I guess. The fixer, right? Zero is 80% terrible for me, but Twitch and all the lovers I've met on here has helped me so much. True. We are some lovelies. Found the meme channel in Discord. Yes, Yuvian. The only thing to remember with that is that we we sort of have the wholesome vibes and stuff. We are family friendly. We do have some young'uns that hang out in there. So as long as they're safe for work, we're all good. <laughs> uh, but yeah, go ahead. I'm uh, I'm always up for a meme. <laughs> we're coming to the UK next year. <gasps> Emery, please, can we meet? And and I will greet you in the in the way that feels appropriate. I know that Ari's a hugger. Hmm. Right, so that's finally an ear. I feel like I haven't done much in this stream, but we've had we've had fun. Hopefully, you have one cat. Why do you have two? Ca what? Wait, what? Neil Gamer wrote a book on Norse mythology. It is the best. He does cover tear. Yes. Uh, I've read Norse Mythology by Neil Gaiman a lot because I love Neil Gaiman and I love Norse Mythology and he writes it in this sort of weirdly casual way and it just works. It's so good. The neighbors guy is here too. Photos or it didn't happen. Found it via a YouTube video last night, got to throw out the jokes on my own channel and confirm it's been okay before we've been Oh, Aflof, I love that. We've returned. Welcome back, Witchycraft. Actually doing good today. Oh, I'm so glad to hear it, Meredith. In a reference to Sun Tzu's Art of War, I know myself still struggling to know my enemy. Yep. If once I read the rules, I appreciate it, Hoovian. Just wanted to check. I had no doubt that you would be uh, that you would be totally lovely and wonderful about it, but just wanted to check. <laughs> Keep the space safe for everyone. Cozy gives amazing hugs. Oh, thanks. I like. I try my best. I have a very deep connection to God or Goddess. Don't know which ones. See spiders, cats, and like occasionally mice, and have wild animals approach me. Ooh, hey, mortal. Not ha not sure how long I can stay because the high winds here. I've had to pop in and say hi. Stay safe, immortal. We love you lots. We've got a few people who are uh, dealing with the weather today, so I hope that you're okay. I hope that you stay safe. I hope that you can still have a lovely weekend, however you're celebrating, if you're celebrating. Um, but yeah, lots of love and blessings to you. Keep us updated and let us know how you're doing. If there's anything that we can do to help, I know we're miles and miles away, but if there's anything we can do, let us know. We love you lots. Can't wait to get a cozy hug. I cannot wait to hug you, Mama Lee. It's gonna be amazing. That ear, you like the ear? You have a grandson named Odin. That's a rad name. And he's five. He's pretty cute. <laughs> I bet he is. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, Lady Lee is definitely Snow White. Yeah, Odin's a fantastic name. He is a cheeky boy, but. <laughs> <laughs> But yeah, I hope you're doing okay, also. I hope everyone, I hope you and yours are staying safe. Um, it's, it's, yeah, weather is being a bit bananas out there. Cats in Discord. Thank you, Maggie. Exclamation book Discord. If you're not in there already, folks, I would love to have you hang out with us. As I said, we're not going to be streaming tomorrow or New Year's Day. But anyone who wasn't here earlier, um, on New Year's Eve, I will not be making anything new. I will be showing um, all the things that we've made together this year. So... We'll hopefully go through them in uh, in chronological order. Uh, order? Words. Chronological order. Um, yeah. Exclamation point Discord. Take a drink. <laughs> I mention the Discord a lot, okay? We have a wonderful community in there and I want everybody to know about it. So, yeah, it will happen. Um... Yeah, so I'm going to wave wave all the uh, bits that I've made this year, including the owl that will be given to Lady Lee next uh, next time. The first time that I get to meet her, which will happen. I'm going to make sure of it. I have an owl to deliver. <laughs> Shiver my timbers at me, break time. <laughs> We've become pirates in here somehow. <laughs> Fun loom pick in Discord. I am looking forward to seeing it, Crafty. Thank you so much for sharing. <laughs> Right, hold on. I will just attach this ear. And then we got antlers, cute face, maybe a little bit of a decoration of some kind to make this into a very Christmassy reindeer. And then we'll be looking at someone lovely to raid out to. Never in a bunch of memes so carefully. Oh, Hoovian, I appreciate your dedication to the wholesomeness. 
you cutie. How the devil is it noon already? I have no idea. I have no clue. Time is weird. Time is timey wimey. It's wibbly wobbly. You know it is. Right. They're not quite there yet, but I'll fiddle around with them and get them into the right positions. Then we get the cute antlers, the cute face, and the cute all the things, because it's cute. Cuteness. It's 7 a.m. <laughs> right, over here it is midday, which means it is break time. I'm going to get up, have a little stretch, go and scritch my little doggy, maybe get myself a little snack, have a little walk around for a second, refill my water. I suggest you do similar. Go and have a little stretch, go and hug someone or something, or yourself. Self hugs are good too. Krumanaka! Uh, no, thanks. Let's, um. I think my channel's good enough, thank you. When are we raiding? Two o'clock! Got two hours, Crafty. <laughs> Christmas card for those in Discord. Oh, Mango. That's very cute. Pirate version of Facebook. Yeah, pirate pirate voices. Yes. <laughs> yeah, we're going to be raiding at 2pm. So in two hours time. Um, so I'm going to go and take a little break. I'm going to leave you with a little reindeer fact. Um, and uh, yeah. Stay cosy and comfy. And I will see you in a few minutes. I'm rambling now. So I'm going to go. Bye. <laughs>